coming up here and seeing all the communities on the way up here, you realise how many people are living up here and how dependent they are on, on the sort of precious, very fragile environment that's here. And as you can see behind us, this, this, this glacier here has been, been here for many, many thousands of years. And as the professor was just telling us, uh, you know, the scientific community is very concerned and very worried about how, how much it's retreated and, and the impacts that's going to have on, on the villages and the communities downstream who, who rely on all this water. I mean, he was saying that 1.6 billion people rely on this water behind us. I mean, that is an enormous amount of people who, bear in mind, a lot of people are now living urban lives. It's very hard to understand living in an urban environment where your water comes from and how precious the actual source of it all is. It was really important to come to Pakistan and, and one, again, see all the different range of environments there are in Pakistan and really trying to get a feel of, of, of the country, but also to, to use our voice, to lend our, our position and, and our visit to kind of talk about issues like climate change, issues about the environment. And, and we've seen all around the world now, the young are getting very engaged in what's going on. And I think it's fantastic that we can, can all come together and, and really have a very good conversation about what we need to do and, and the action needs to happen very soon because a lot of people rely on this and if we take too long about this we will lose many of the precious things we care about.